Hello my friends, okay then, so uh, today I'm going to look at um, some armour recipes on Junk Jack X. Um, let me say, there, there's like a common way of doing these. Um, I believe that I have them all in my craft book now, but that's just the craft book, which doesn't mean to say that there aren't others out there. So, um, anyway, let's go through the armour. So, we have this kind of like configuration here, which is... Um, two ingots on the left and the right and then two ingots in the middle and then a um, a bar in the middle on top of that. That seems to be like a, a common denomination concerning um, armour. So that's like an, an antanium bar. So if you can see here with copper it's exactly the same and then again with um, an iron armour it's exactly the same but it's not the same with the turtle stuff. So for example there you go you've got a uh, the green turtle chest, which is right there, so it's three along in the middle, and the two bits of wool, I believe, uh, silk yarn even. Um, and again, uh, the mithril armor chest is exactly the same as it was before. Um, the red turtle chest again is the um, the red turtle shell in the middle, and the yarn, um, just like opposite those. Uh, again, the silver armor chest, which is right there with the ingots and the bar, um, the titanium. Armour chest, again, exactly the same. And that's pretty much it. Um, one second. For some reason, I can't find uh, a gold chest. I don't know why that is, but it just doesn't seem to be there. Oh, no, there it is. Look, yep, exactly the same again. So that's pretty much it. If you just find that configuration, and that's how you make armour in Junk Jack X, and um, unless it's the turtle armour, which is ever so slightly different. Well, it's, it's a big difference, actually. Um, but you've seen the configuration of how to do those as well. Anyway, I hope it helps my friends, and I'll see you in the next video.